Okay, hi guys. Um, this is another opportunity to apply for the second round of the Finland study um, programs. And this opportunity is free. It's totally free and it doesn't require any um, search for scholarship. I mentioned um, somebody in my previous video, the live session where we had, uh, that was Kingsley. Kingsley came in through this program last year, um, Masters in Mathematics, and he's currently studying this program. So I want you to prepare yourself with the necessary documents, and then you should, for by now, start by um, selecting your interested uh, programs or programs you are interested in. You should start by searching those programs now, and that's why I'm making this video. So if, it, if this is the first time you'll be joining us on this platform, I encourage you to subscribe so that you can get updates of my upcoming um, scholarship opportunities like this. And at the same time, uh, um, in order for you to understand how to com complete your application till you get here in Finland or anywhere you are applying to, all right, the very first step to apply for um, scholarship in Finland is to go to the usual website, which is www.studyinfo.fi. So that is the portal. So you come to this portal. I'm going to uh, attach the link to this portal in the description below. So now the first thing... What you're going to notice is that the uh, website might be written in Finnish because that is the official language of Finland. So, but don't worry. All you know, need to do is to either translate, just like I have it on my screen. You translate it and it all will be in English or you uh, go to the settings of your computer and translate it back to English. It is possible so when you're done you're going to have this page like this and then we are looking for the second round application which would open on 13th of march and you want to know all the programs available uh during this application round the first round has ended as you can see on the screen and this is the second round so what you do first is to go to look at the uh, left hand side of the of the screen of the screen here, yeah, le left hand side of the website, you come to application period. Then you read about the application period here. Then you, you, when you're done, you as you can see here, that the second joint application round. Let me put it down. Yeah. So the first, the second joint application to higher education, and that's what you are applying for. So you receive the, what's it called? The application opens on the 13th of uh, March, as you can see, and it ends on the 27th of March. So this is the basic information you need about this joint application. Secondly, uh, the you can apply to up to six different programs at the same time without stress. So now you come to, when you're done with that, you go to finish higher education, this particular place, and then you click on uh, higher education degrees. Then you have bachelor's. So if you're applying for bachelor's program, you click on list of bachelor's programs. If you're applying for a master's program, um, you, you scroll down and you see uh, master's options here. And you should remember that Finland has two different universities, two different types of universities. Um, we have um, the normal, usual university, and then we have uh, universities of applied sciences. So if you are studying anything related to sciences, applied sciences, you click on list of universities of applied sciences uh, available. So when you're done with that, you scroll down to list of master's programs available. So if it is bachelor's degree you are looking for, you go back to list of bachelor's programs available. Now these are the list of programs available in Finland that will be uh, that you can apply to. 
But because some of these programs might have closed in the first round, then you come to this um, filter on the left hand side. So you you go to um, you scroll down, and then you come to application ongoing. Is either you click on application ongoing or you click on application start within a month. So because the program we want to apply for is starting within a month, then we are clicking on application start within a month. And you can see we have about 356 programs available uh, that will be opening. Yeah. So when you click on this, you have the list of programs that would be opening in this month and that you can apply to. So secondly, or the third thing is that some of this information about these um, programs would be in Finnish. And I'm going to show you how to translate easily from Finnish or Swedish to English so you can apply for this program. So uh, if you come across Finnish on the website, don't be scared, it's normal. In fact, when you get to Finland, you're going to do more of, you're going to relate more, more with Finnish words on the signboard and all. So um, I want to streamline my application because all these applications here might require a fee. So you might be required to pay 10,000 uh, euros or 12,000 euros annually for these programs. But because um, this particular video is for those who want to study for free. If you if you don't mind um, paying these fees, then you can apply for any of these um, programs you can see on my screen. Okay? So I would go to my left-hand side as usual, then I click on uh, fee. Where is it? I click on fees, then I come to study, programs free of charge. So you click on study programs free of charge and you have list of programs that are free in Finland. So we have um, masters in economies and business administration, two years. So almost all the programs in Ubo Academy, Ubo Academy is uh, a very close by university to University of Turku where I'm currently studying. Uh, in fact, the translation of University of Turku is actually Obo Academy. Obo Academy is a Swedish university, and you can learn more about this university uh, on your own. So this is Obo Academy. So most of the programs here, as you can see, Masters of Arts, Obo Academy, 120 ECTS, are free, free of charge. So you look for what interests you in any of these programs, mathematics, physics, chemistry, geology. I mentioned um, somebody in my previous video, the live session where we had, uh, that was Kingsley. Kingsley came in through this program last year, um, Masters in Mathematics, and he's currently studying this program for free, even though it is in Swedish. The lecturers, they take their time to translate to English, and they assist him with um, English translated materials, which um, is working with now. Um, if there are some programs as well that are both in English and Finnish, uh, I think this program is both Finnish and English. Yeah, you can see the language of instruction for this program is Finnish and English. So you can apply to this program as well. And you have the, what's it called, the information here. You read the admission criteria and then you you start applying to this program. Basically, you need your bachelor's transcripts, you need um, you need your IELTS results and some other, uh, what's it called, documents like your passport and everything uh, to apply for all these things in Finland. Now, let me quickly take you through how to translate your documents and to trans translate this information on the website easily. So what we want to translate is actually uh, the, the uh, admission criteria. So what you do is you click on this, you click on everything like this, you highlight everything, and then you copy. So when you copy, you go to your Google Docs or you go to Microsoft Word, 
So this is an example. Then you paste it here. You can see everything is in finish right now. So what you do is you come to tools. Then you go to translate. Where is it? Where is that translate? Yeah, translate document. Then you click. And then you can title it. Choose the language, which is English. And then you translate. So it's going to open another page entirely for you. Aha. So you see admission criteria, master's application, master's program in biotechnological, biomedical engineering and all. So you have everything in English right now. So you can always read through the uh, uh, admission criteria, the documents you need and other things. So basically you can apply with your um, bachelor's degree certificate and transcripts and um, you can you need your motivation letter as well i've made a video on how to write a motivation letter and then you need your cv i have made um, a video on how to make uh, how to how to make um, a good cv for most especially finland application which i give an example of my um, cv during that uh, in that video which you can as well check so this is basically what i want to show you on how to navigate through um, the second round of this application. Remember, this application opens on March 13th and it ends on March 27th. So you have nothing less than 14 days to apply. I wish you the very best of luck. If this is the first time you come into this channel, kindly subscribe and like this video and share so that you can get updates on my upcoming videos. Thank you and bye-bye.